Hello and welcome to the Daily Comic and Collectible, episode 193. Now today, the collectible of the day is the Mezco Toys Marvel Comics 112 Collective Doctor Strange Action Figure. Dr. Stephen Strange, M.D., was once a prominent but egotistical surgeon. Following a tragic automobile accident, he searched the world for a way to heal his badly damaged hands. After becoming a student of the Ancient One, Strange not only mastered the martial arts, but the mystical arts as well. He now serves as Sorcerer Supreme, and from his base in the Sanctum Sanctorum, he guards the world from mystical and magical threats. Doctor Strange joins the 112 Collective with a comprehensive detailed outfit and unique character-specific accessories. Each 112 Collective Doctor Strange figure is packaged in a deluxe collector-friendly box. Designed with collectors in mind, there are no twist ties for easy in and out of package display. This product features a 112 scale design standing 6.3 inches tall. It's based on the Marvel Comics character, and the body features over 28 points of articulation. It's hand painted, authentic, detailed, includes cloak of levitation with integrated wire for dynamic posing. The box includes Doctor Strange, the 112 collective figure, six interchangeable hands, two interchangeable Eye of Agamotto's one open and one closed, sculpted gloves on each hand, the cloak of levitation, astral form projection, which attaches to the posting post, defensive spell effects, offensive spell effects, and a 112 collective display base with logo and 112 collective adjustable display post. Made by Mesco Toys. Now, the comic of the day is Strange Academy number one with a cover date of May 2020. This is the first volume in a completely new series with story by Scotty Young, art by Humberto Ramos, and this is the Walmart exclusive second printing variant by Humberto Ramos. Finally, a sorcerer's school for the Marvel Universe. The magical universe has changed in such an alarming way that Doctor Strange, already mentioned earlier, has done what he avoided for decades. He's opened a school for young sorcerers. Young people from around the world with aptitude in magic have been brought together in New Orleans to study the mystic arts under Strange, Brother Voodoo, the Ancient One, the Scarlet Witch, Ileana Rasputin, better known as Magic, Hellstrom, and all your favorite Marvel magicians. But with all the new magical threats, is it already too late? This is a massive key issue with huge speculation interest due to all the first appearances alone. So buckle in and tighten up that safety belt. This could be a bumpy ride. First up is the biggest and most obvious of all, the first appearance of the Strange Academy itself. But then we move on to the more interesting intel. We have the first appearance of Emily Bright, and her origin is revealed. The first appearance of Shaylee Moonpetal. The first appearance of Alvi and Eric, whose first names are revealed and are twins from Asgard. The first appearance of Gooselog, a young frost giant who was enrolled at the Academy on the recommendation of Loki. The first appearance of Doyle Dormammu, the son of Dormammu, who is the Lord of Dark Dimension and the Lord of Chaos. Doyle, just like his father, is made up of pure mystical energy. It's the first appearance of Zoe Laveau, a descendant of Marie Laveau, voodoo witch queen of New Orleans. The first appearance of Calvin Morse, a foster kid who used a magical jacket to get into the academy that turned out to be Mr. Misery. The first appearance of Desi, daughter of the famous demon Sayim, who is the most beautiful native demon of Limbo, the first appearance of Germain, who is a Nahul, who can enter the animage stage and create animal projections. It's also the first appearance of Toth, who is made of pure crystal 
and son of the crystal warrior Bladir and Man-Thing, who lives in the swamp of Weird World. Toth is known as a crystal warrior Man-Thing. Geek Fact At the Academy, students could use their magic freely without worrying about the cost of the spells. Also, Strange struck a deal with Hogoth, an extremely ancient and powerful entity of order, who ensured that the school would receive unlimited magic, as long as the students were well trained to face an upcoming challenge. Uh oh. Well, I'd like to thank you for joining me for today's Daily Comic and Collectible, and I hope to see you again tomorrow. This is Cat Fan Comics Man, and I'll catch you on the flip. Over and out. Yeah.